good afternoon and happy Thursday. I thought about doing throwback Thursday like we did last week, but I don't, uh, I don't feel it. I was scrolling through, uh, Instagram and a person I follow, Joe Cooks, is, uh, she had made quesadillas, uh, buffalo chicken quesadillas, and I thought, I got a rotisserie chicken I can cut up and, um, make us that. I kind of felt like having some some fun food and that's what we have today so i just wanted to share again you know leftovers can be or things that you just have in the refrigerator can be awesome um a second time around so let me just show you what i have real quick and um you may have different ingredients and i want you to be inspired by what you have in your refrigerator so i just took the rotisserie chicken and chopped it up and i'll show that to you in just a moment and got it ready for the sauce that i made it's nice and so i instead of just regular buffalo sauce i like spicy garlic so i took about three fourth cup of um um red hot and then i added about a fourth of a tape of a stick of butter and then i added two teaspoons of garlic and more if you like and um some fresh cracked pepper uh probably about a teaspoon. So you feel free to play around with things. Don't be stuck in what I tell you. It's just a, a way to be whimsical and um, use the ingredients in your house. So I took that. And I think the other thing I want you all to think about with leftovers is how you present things, how you make them look good. Cause we eat with our eyes, then our noses and then our mouths. So if it looks good, smells good, it's gonna taste good. So uh, again, um, let me stop real quick. I'm the Leftover Ninja. My name's Vinny. And uh, if you like my videos, please subscribe, hit like, and please share. Okay, so told you about what we did with the buffalo chicken and or spicy garlic chicken, whatever you want to make. And so I cut up some um, fresh organic carrots and then I had some scallions sitting around. And so I added the scallions and some parsley to the buffalo chicken. So it's a little cold because it's waiting to be put in the quesadilla. But I added a little bit of fresh ingredients to what I already had. And then, um, you know, I'm gonna give you some vegetables. I got some um, red or purple onion, whatever you wanna call it. And some uh, seedless, English cucumber. So that's what I got right here, you know, and then I have lettuce. So this will all go on a bed of lettuce. I'll click a picture, post it on my channel so you can see the final product. But I did want to jump on and share with you guys. And you know, I'm still working with these wraps, the whole wheat and flaxseed. So I love these. Um, and they have low net carbs and a lot of fiber. So just wanted to come on. Um, you are here with the Leftover Ninja, and I really appreciate you guys coming in and checking me out. And um, please be sure to put some comments of things you might want me to talk about or share with you as we continue to go on this journey together. Um, don't forget, hit like, share, and subscribe if um, you want to continue to see me. I appreciate you and I'll post a picture so you can see what we had today. All right, be safe, be kind, be well.